<laughs> Gotta hurry. Not time to wait, except for five months. <laughs> because yeah. it's totally necessary um, to point that out. Logan, what time is it? Oh, the year 2017 again. <laughs> On this week's edition of Oh, is he still alive? We <laughs> I know, right? It felt like yesterday we we, we planted a bowling ball straight to his noggin. Mm -hmm. I love shows that destroy By the way, just to elaborate real quick before it gets lost in the chaos, unless it wasn't made apparent already, um, we won't be able to join us for the remainder of this series due to various situations. At least with this one. Hopefully in later seasons things will free up for everybody. Yeah, probably. I think I think by the time we get to that, that by we get to then, it's probably gonna be like summertime and everyone's free by then. Yeah, maybe. Mm -hmm. He famously demanded over eleven thousand retakes. Jesus of the line. Christ! You made me mess up. Made all the more annoying because of his tendency to repeat the line immediately after <laughs> because it's it. Following the show, Spex was rarely seen in public. Although he did make one ill-fated adventure into celebrity tag team oh, mud wrestling, getting pinned in a record three seconds Jeez, as he desperately wow. tried to wipe down the ring with That's a dish rag. That's the whole purpose. Mm. Utterly enraged his tag team partner and good friend, the dog from My Mother the Wait, Dog. What? My yeah? Mother the Dog. Without a word. They haven't spoken since. I guess you could say his mother Coming really was a bitch. Soda popper who hey Keep it in. Yeah, and I'm not going to listen to that soda pop. Again. Yeah, that's that's uh, too hot for TV. Yeah, you did, did actually watch that, I think, multiple times to learn about them, but it's they're, they're freaking dated ch children's stars. Well, yeah, and speaking of which, in this part, we should be meeting our third one. Third and yep. final one, we should add. Oh, yeah, by the way, oh. ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, and the final one. It should be... What? Well, looks like someone's <laughs> someone's looking for odd jobs. Yeah, anyway... Piercings therapist. She tried piercings, tattoos. Now apparently she's a psychotherapist. And oh, there he is. Oh dear. She looks up. And there's someone in the closet. Welcome. Closet. You look like you could use some therapy. Not from a wide-eyed circus freak like <laughs> you. Hey, it's another one of the soda poppers. Me? Couldn't already tell by this what outfit. Your uh... peepers. I don't know what you're talking about. My name is Civil Pandemic, licensed psychotherapist. Huh. Okay, sorry. You were saying James? Anyway, it should be said, ladies and gentlemen, uh, since the first part up to here, I've actually been playing a good chunk of season one, and I'm already at, I've already beaten about five of the uh, episodes. Or, or even, yeah, there's like six episodes. Yeah, I'm on, I'm on the sixth episode now, so I'm up to date here. Yay, you'll be able to bounce back commentary with me. Yay! At least with what I remember, anyway. And I'm here for the rapid. Yep. Certainly! Tell me what's bothering you. But no, that's fine. That, that, but no, that's still fine. I mean, it's you, you have you have more experience with them in the comics and TV show than I do. Well, actually, I'm not quite sure I can really say that because I only have experience with the games and the TV show. You or the, I think you're a little bit more familiar with the comics than I am, and that's where they freaking came from. True. How ironic! How ironic! This comic book junkie actually is not familiar with the comics compared to the gaming junkie. Well, I know they were comic book characters. I just never took the time to read them until recently. Have you got a copy of this cockamamie video? I'm all out, but they probably still got a truck. So apparently, over this guy is, you know, he's clearly not civil and he's Who's trying this to. Culture person? Brady. And he's Brady trying culture. to. Sell us more of that. He's still trying to whore. He's, he's trying to still. Yeah, he's trying to shill it out to it's us. He's Penn? still trying to whore out that Brady culture. I'm so disillusioned. No, I like Sean Penn. Enough said. Um, yeah, psychoanalyzing me, no matter Excuse what you me, say, he's just gonna say, oh, you should try Ibo. Uh, oh, maybe that, maybe try some Ibo. Oh, and maybe if you're free this evening, try some more Ibo. So, we need to do this. Do you have change for an onion? Something that's... Worry. This won't hurt a bit. No! Oh! <laughs> but it will make you cry. Tell me about Sorry. It. It, it. Yeah, he has giant freaking eyes, and this thing is perfect for things. And now that he can't see me coming. Oh, no. Now, peepers, this is going to hurt us a lot more than it's going to hurt you. Just kidding. <laughs> It'll definitely hurt you more. Crack it. Sweet dreams, peeps. Paunch. I can see you. <laughs> you know, that wasn't quite as impactful as, as I was expecting. Was yeah, I was expecting was to at great. least send them into the couch in behind him. My evil he just kind of. plan is in ruins. The dog and bunny will rue the day they crossed me. Rue the day, I say. <laughs> okay, that's starting to get yeah, better. That was, there we that go. was a better laugh. He was rehearsing it later. Now, he, now he's got it. All right, let's open the door. And inside, you'll find hello, a, a woman. So long. It's I was a woman. Stories for the mothballs. I've got to sit down. 
Oh my that god, it... he's still here? Come we are. On. We are the cops, ma'am. We're, 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 we're cops, lady. We're freelance In a certain Civil definition pandemic. of the word. Licensed psychotherapist. Nice to know ya. Arrest that lunatic And apparently, I don't know how long they've been in that office, but apparently, this is the first time Sybil's ever met them, even though they live next door from each other. Say, that's perfect. Mm -hmm. because I They've probably just never been in the building until someone. now. And now I can do something about it. Probably. I mean, we were always familiar with the Bosco building, but this thing, for all we know, this thing, this, uh, nice establishment was only rented out just recently. Yeah. Yeah. Say anywhere I can put a piercing on this, on this bod. Come again? <laughs> You've got to knock them unconscious to bring them out of it. Then you can help them overcome the hypnosis. Huh. Allow okay. me to demonstrate. Take control of your mind. I don't think he can hear you. Sure he can. He's unconscious. He's not, not dead. He's not fully Might dead. He's just failed. mostly dead. Destroy the intruder. Also, take note, ladies and gentlemen, she only just started this job recently. What? Well, for someone that just started it recently, she did a good job of breaking here? him out of it. What's going on? Sybil? Yeah, so I guess you thwack him first and then do that whole little yes, process to, I guess, okay? hit the power on and off switch on their mind. I had the weirdest dream. Also, I know this isn't the, the same actor, but I swear to God, I, when I listen to Peeper's voice, he sounds like some—he sounds like someone that Frank Welker would voice. I get more of a Dennis Snyder vibe out of him. I knew it. That fiend hypnotized you to say so. unspeakable bidding. I'll say, yeah, we just now learned that, yes, it is Brady Culture, of course, who's been hypnotizing people. Brady home, for child home for former child stars. How specific. Huh. I didn't think... Wow, who... This guy. Where can we well, help who... home for former child stars? But if, that, stars. if they have that house, oh, then who else will give us such amazing win. moments no like Fuller House and, and, and that other show people apparently we want it back so on the television for some reason? Like in, or, yeah. I mean, where else will you find such lovable stars like Invader Zim? Oh, yeah, speaking of which... My yeah, by the time we recorded this, me. finally, okay, uh, they announced the revival. Oh yeah, I just saw you guys posting as about a, that. And of course, Jordan is a static. As a TV movie, no less. Oh yeah, definitely. Anywho, so now that we understand that Brady Culture seems, that Brady Culture seems to be the one behind these hypnotizing, hypno, hi, hypnosis spree, we also have a lead on where he potentially could be. Okay, let's try and reset these other people. Uh, yeah. Take control of your mind. Is it working? I don't know. Destroy the intruder in your dreams. Snap out of it, you big baby. Yeah. What? That What's works. Going on? All takes is some really is carefully cho carefully picked words. He's yep. Back. Nothing. Quick, act like a chicken. No. Nothing. Tell nothing us where like we good self-esteem pep talk can fix. Stars. We've got to stop that fiend from hypnotizing anyone else. The home. It's two, two, seven. That feeling seven. when you realize that this game. That feeling when you realize this game's already a decade old. Can you Isn't that something there? we said in the first part? Yeah. I I think so, but it's more of emphasize here because, well, go figure, it's already 2017. This game came out in 2006. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it, the, the the graphics definitely show it, but I it, it'll step up in the later seasons. Don't oh, worry. Oh yeah, well, that's fair. Anyway, let's go back to Bosco. Your family real quick. may be in danger. Help ourselves to some of Mr. Weenie's hot weenies. Hey, Bosco. Bosco. Busker. Hey, a Bosco. Buy something. What do you got to owl? Uh, we got any. Do you have any weasels on a stick? Oh, well, that's a comic um, reference. Do you have any two handed broadswords? Don't know what that is. Do you have any vegetables in the yeah, shape? Yeah, that's a hit the road reference. That's a hit the road reference. Nope. Nothing for us Aww. right now. No, John, no John Muir eggplants for us. Aww. Who's John Moore? Take control of your mind. Destroy the intruder in your dreams. Oh, John Muir. Anyway, actually, fun fact: the college I'm at, University Where Pacific, like John Muir is like a big you? like symbol for them Don't or something. Yeah. Freelance police. Speaking of John Muir, that's the middle school I oh, went to. No. Huh? Ooh. We are so connected right now somehow. He's I'll say. Quick. Oh, that also, story. crap! We gotta follow him. I was about to say. To the Desoto. Yep. I was about to say. Also, helps that you should actually have oh, met him in real life. He's away. Hmm. Meanwhile, I'm saying like just, just in general, like, like, like I'm finding new and unusual ways for us to bond from Sam and Max for some reason. Sam and Car careful lads, those, the yeah. I was just gonna say Sam and Max brings oh, families yes. and friends together in the most odd ways. Take the wheels, <laughs> should. Watch out. Okay, careful. I gotta, get, I gotta get the wheels. Whoa! Oop. What the hell? Well, I guess when I triggered it, they had to put me here so that this animation would make sense. I guess so. Yo. 
You're under arrest. I probably should have said that before shooting you. Don't you want to escape me, copper? And he just run, zips off like a Sonic character, like he's been for the past while. Yeah. Seriously, all that soda. Value, of course. It's just sport value. You always see cops on the news beating up some guy just because he's a former child yeah, star. It only happens. We would never dream of hurting former child stars. Well, they are a class of their own, kid. Find the home where Brady I mean, keeps sir. Them. Oh, why didn't you say so? It's right over there. Well, that's convenient. The well, that was for Well. Wow. How devilish Yes, it is. Thanks. All right, uh, good luck with the tire. <laughs> Oh, that's um, right, we did shoot him out, didn't we? Know where I can find a bathroom? You're standing in it. <laughs> no. <laughs> Lower Manhattan. No, I don't. I will not say yeah, there's that. There's a old man. Part of New York we're in, anyway. Looks like a shifty hey, character. Hey, Harry Moleman. Don't they all? Wasn't... So Harry Moleman, he was from Hit the Road as I, well? Yeah, I think he's from Hit the Road. Hmm. The Black Hole. What's a black hole, Sam? It's a star that's been crushed under its own weight, destined to desolate darkness for it's all... It's like Britney Spears. Let him kiss. Nah, the joke was there. Okay, the joke this was there. We were all thinking it, something like that. I just said it. Artificial personality disorder. Sounds tasty. What's in it? Apparently, it's common in former child stars. Symptoms include. What are the symptoms? See, obsession obsession with, fame, with fame. Violent reactions violent to hair styling. Hair styling. Unconscious desire to see one's peers getting older. Peers getting older. Hmm. Or so. You don't even know what that means. Well, it's a good thing none of us fit that bill. Am I right? It's all classically literate. <laughs> So the idea here is that now we have another little weird Just quest with this monkey. creepy monkey Reminds thing. Me of a job I had oh, that kind of critter. You're a monkey? Essentially. Alley of perpetual you know, it's not... <laughs> you know, it's not any more out of place than out of Maybe place dogs, than the man. dog cop and the rabbity thing Back here. To the office. True. Good old. So we need to get. We, it will not let us in, like, literally it's like a freaking ticket booth thing where we can't get in unless we have artificial personality disorder. In other words, we need to be committed. Time to fix some medical and bills. And no one better to do the com... And no one better to do the commitment than Sybil, who was stuck in her T-pose. What the <laughs> heck? What the heck? Why are you stuck in your T-pose? Get out of here. I think my fucking day training. Artificial personality disorder? Hmm. Interesting. The Something GOG version has some uh, kinks in it that other versions may have yeah. fixed. Good thing, good thing, this, good thing that I haven't run across anything that bad in the Steam version, older. though. For hey, some odd reason, I can't I run in the Steam like version. The yeah, and I own the original. My brother got me all three right. seasons, actually. Now, the original PC versions of them from Christmas a couple years ago. I lost the code to play the season one episodes, though. Okay. Well, so... So we need to fill out the three qualifications. So first, for the ink blots, we need to figure out that violent reactions to hair care, to hair, oh no, not hair, no. We need to, uh, we need to work about, we, okay. Sorry. I'm getting deep, mixed deep up. Breath, deep breath, deep breath. When people talk, it makes me, I'm sorry. So with ink blots, we need to say anything that has anything to do with fames, such as Susan Lucci holding an Emmy. Who's, who's Susan, Susan Lucci holding so, an Emmy? I see. I have no clue. Dated. Now, how about this one? Uh... Uh, si fame. Siamese mermaids. So fame, Chinese theater. Pigeons on the moon. Well, oh, Siamese mermaids sounds funnier. It does. And this? Um, a, a, a skeleton frog beetle thing, or fame, an autograph. An autograph written in. Uh, blood. Photoshop Flowey. Now this one. What do you see? <laughs> um, lungs, torn apart apparently. Uh, cheering. Oh, red herring. <laughs> a cheering crowd of lanky albinos. <laughs> And um, a turtle. That's not very funny. It's Bentley. Oh, God. Uh, What's uh, Kingdom Hearts 3 fodder. That blotchy thing that a flashbulb does to That is also mind. true. Well, your choices indicate an obsession with fame. That's oh, yeah, I just realized, yeah, the, 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 uh, the blotchy light bulb thing, you could imply that that's, like, from paparazzi, so, yeah, more fame. Yeah, yeah. it's kind of like those spots you see in your eyes when you see a bright flash of light. Other symptoms of APD. Whatever you yeah, say, I hate that. Bones. I'm not a sawbones. So now we need to worry about the next, uh, of our tomato, little symptoms. Hey, I'm getting now shush, Max. <laughs> What's free okay, this one's actually pretty humorous. Speaking to me, I think you know what right now. This one's pretty humorous. We need to show, we need to display violent reactions to... Dance a song the recite the alphabet, scream at the Oh, top of my God. Lungs, you know, that's, that should be easy. Just get, mm. just have Sam give Max a, Max an afro and let him go to town. Ready? No, but now we will. So here we go. Ready? Is that the word? No, the word is tumbleweed. So, you can just keep talking to her and just say whatever. Lamp black. But, wait for it. Now try this one. 
crown. Just do or say whatever crown. comes naturally. Crown is related to... Man, just a headpiece. I'm fine. Promenade. Promenade. I see. Promenade. Come. 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 Did you see? Come. Come. Whoa. Whoa. Violent reaction. Violent reaction. You should see him at Thanksgiving. <laughs> <laughs> Violent reaction. <laughs> Thank you, Max. Interesting. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, this has yeah, been you just have to wait for the one hair yeah. care related Your thing and whip out the gun. to believe that you have an unusually violent Don't reaction to shoot her. That's not until another episode. <laughs> oh dear. Don't worry, it's it staged. Could be symptomatic of artificial personality Maybe. disorder. I'd better mark this on your chart. Okay. How are your new you how are new symptoms going on for so long? Form. Am I deranged? I Physics. don't want to alarm you, but That is the point of it. Good. Can I have your hat when they commit you? Sure, little buddy. <laughs> I was half expecting my range. Uh, probably. Really oh, good. I was like always worried if something bad was happening. That sounds like something oh, Max would say, though. They reveal your subconscious. It's it's like peeling an onion. In fact, I would admit, I would imagine Max would be the first one to be committed. Subconscious are like thing. onions. Okay. Stink. Yes. No. <laughs> yes. No. But this time. No, they're more like they're more like ogres. Yes, I can picture it's, it. The inner machination, machinations of my mind are an enigma. <laughs> I remember Meanwhile. that I'd just gotten something from the bakery. Oh, is there going to be a celebration? Uh, what did you get? get? A birthday cake. So yeah, now the other thing is we have to have dreams cake. or mm. the Someone's interest year closer of to the grave, eh? our friends getting older. So we have a birthday cake, you know, representing getting older. Now we just need a friend. And I here's the telltale there random model else in the from that one poker game they oh, did. Oh, you had a special guest. Who was it? Uh, Max. It was Max. And his tea post. Ah, oh, yes. Your imaginary <laughs> friend. Wait a second. Hey, pin the tail on me! I'll be, I'll gouge your eyes out! You, you probably would. Birthday cake. Want to see your peers get <laughs> cake. Your friend stuck in a tea pose. This, this is, is a oh, I, I understand it. This is a definite disorder. symptom of Ubisoft's yes, I mean, demand oh, to I release games serious. annually. Well, real quick, before it fades oh, away, no. on the clipboard is a picture of the human enigma. Wow! It yeah. must be and and also the paper disorder. bag uh, Max hat, the, the paper bag puppet. Max puppet thingy. I get a paper out of this. Best ship me off to some sort of home for former child stars then. <laughs> I've signed this admissions form, but you'll have to arrange your own transportation. I'm about to be really busy publishing the details. Yeah, you and half of the freaking Middle West drive, for us at this point. All this for this, <laughs> all this for the sake, all this for the sake of making the papers. Max will never drive. Just like he'll never answer never. the phone. I don't think... Except for one episode, but that was under special circumstances. Circumstances that were comedically arranged, and then Where we going, Sam? let's go to the home for home for more child Back stars. To we're getting home pretty for close child to the stars. end of this episode. Oh, already. Okay. Yeah, this episode's really not that long, so all the episodes aren't really all yeah, that Yeah, this long. was like the. But yeah, well, they also make up for the fact that this this season has a whopping six of them. Only one of the three that to have true. that many. I'm officially certifiable. Yep, I uh -huh. think the, I think the only other Telltale seasons that have had more than six are I Minecraft. Think, didn't Jurassic Park, Minecraft, Minecraft has had more than six, I think now with all the weird DLC. I think the other one was. Um, Would Walking um, Dead count? No, 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 no. Walking Dead has always had about five, I think. Can we get ice cream? I think not counting the, uh, not counting the uh, extra hungry. DLC. Yeah, not not counting four hundred days. Um, this reminds me of that place where Aunt Trudy lives, with the medicine smell and the rubber sheets and the enormous mutant. No, Indian. you're thinking of one flew over. like a million laps. laughs. Yeah, mostly after medication time. Where is everybody? This uh -oh. is this is some home for ch more former child stars, and here's our what the hell? Pulcritude An organ does. player. This is Culture's Clubhouse. Jump. Uh, dude, the seventy the seventies are that way. Brady <laughs> Culture, I presume. I, that afro oh, is very stock. Wow. Evil plans really do. Actually, kind of looks like yeah. a pillow. Don't get too what, excited, stretch pants. Yeah, okay, I was gonna say, looks like styrofoam. Yeah. More like popcorn to me. And in all those spray, and all those spray painted like drawings of him, I used to think that was just like a background. Like he was just yeah. bald. I had no idea that was actually an afro. You know, I kind of want to make a joke about the afro, but that kind of spoils something that happens at the beginning of two. I think we just triggered or episode two anyway. That's fair. Yeah. Oh, crap! I talked over it. Sorry. You know what? Up? Oh no! Oh dang it! Yeah, me too. We missed our one of my favorite jokes this episode. I think oh. we just triggered us a little. Good thing I have the attention span of a pint of yak butter. But no. 
Those worthless hacks, the soda poppers, with their magic. You know what else? You know what else is drawn on in this game? Jingles, hmm. His chest hair. I just saw that. Yeah. Too. My audience. <laughs> <laughs> he's not a real man. So apparently he's not. Oh, apparently he is the worst than a child actor. He was a freaking sitcom adult guy from the 80s or 70s. Okay, I think we're good. Tune back in. He's jealous of their success. He wants to drive them insane and out of business. I'm afraid you'll just have to take their places. Uh -oh. In your no. dreams, culture. No, my friend. Da da da. No. Vision. And now for Can one of the most pickles? more what the fuck oh, parts in this entire video, episode. And of course, delivery. Max is immune because his brain's too much of an enigma to control. Definitely. Be like trying to freaking lasso. Oh, I love one of the tiger. lines coming up here. What? What's happening? Oh no! Oh no! What, what are you doing? I don't know. I... You were in on it all along. I told you it was a conspiracy. I told mm -hmm. you... Oh, uh, no, it happens a little later, my bad, but still. Kinda... No, Bosco, I must deliver video. So... Right here. Call the CIA! Call Interpol! Call Mickey Why? Rooney! Must deliver... <laughs> I was like, where are we so What? He becomes... Like, we're, we're just as confused. I was like, he, he breaks out just for a second to question that. What? So, it, yes. it, which means he can be saved. So tune in the next part where we actually do save him. Right. Yes, we have to break out of this trance somehow. Bye-bye. See you. Find Gironi, though.